the first thing you must do as a singer when listening to song is not to listen to lyrics it's the first thing to do is to do what enjoy the song let it sink into your soul this is the reason one the harmonies in the song must catch and must sync with the harmonies you express whilst listening to a song that's one thing secondly is take note of these three things the melody the harmony and the rhythm now most singers do not really understand what the melody is what the harmony is and what the rhythm is okay they just listen to songs you know generally and they feel good about themselves which is wrong your ability to listen to these things pay distinctive or distinct attention to each of these particular layers gives you a good clarity of what music really really is all right now the second thing we have to look at is what we call the lyrical progression now after you're done listening to what is the melody the harmony and the rhythm and sorry to say if you don't understand what the melody harmony and rhythm is you have to sign up my class all right so i'll teach you better the next thing you have to go into is the lyrical progression so from the word lyrical progression we already can and predict what it means which means to move a song from one lyrics to another from one word to another to decipher the, um, the words of each of the songs now having understood the emotions of the song or listening to the song you now go into the lyrical content of the song and look at the way each of these contents are to get one your pronunciation to get the pronunciation and then two to decide where your breath control techniques is going to be applied so we have the breath control and we have the breath management so where do you apply the breath control the air release and all that is decided in that pattern and then you now go into what we call the projection of your lyrics how you project yourself into the lyrics to become the lead role in the lyrics remember as a singer you must understand that you're an artist you're an actor okay you're an artist and you are also an actor so your music must fulfill must create a balance in this two sphere and in that way you become musically grounded and then you can also replicate the music you've listened to in a better form and appeal to their emotions thank you very much this is nugget for today and i hope you've learned something please do not forget to subscribe to our youtube channel on um, uh, chris david's and click on the subscribe button so you can get much more information from me when I drop my next videos. Thank you very much.